and as you can see the long thing on the top is actually a compass sensor that way it can turn exactly 90 degree turns um, no matter what the surface rather than having a predefined amount which um, loses a bit of accuracy each time you make a turn it's not perfect but it doesn't need to be perfect for it to run through so it should start by going forward it should sense that the right side is more area turn right go forward turn left go forward turn left again go forward then turn right into the dead end find that it's a dead end turn left okay so here we go and as you can see I have the program loaded task to maze program so I'm just gonna press the button and press run and right now Tell me to use the left and right buttons to calibrate the angle. So maybe just a bit that way. That looks pretty good. Okay, so now it's telling me press the orange button when I'm done. Now I'm done. So I'm just gonna press the orange button. Now it's telling me to use the left and right buttons to calibrate the eyes so maybe that is pretty good and as you can see after my first touch, it told me to press the orange button when I'm done. So, this is going to start the maze. This is going to start going through the maze. And the maze is a bit rough, but it should be good enough for it to go through it properly. So, let's try. Also, on screen, there are are text prompts that say either driving turn left turn right or dead end if it does come across a dead end and every time it senses a wall and decides to turn it's just gonna warn you of that so as you can see it found a dead end and it turned twice rather than doing its normal pivot turn I might put a wall there. And I might put a wall like that. Maybe like that. Dead end. Okay, so now I'm just going to show the what the screen says. I'm just going to run it, calibrate the angle, calibrate um, the ultrasonic sensor, which I like to call the eyes, and this thing is already calibrated. It doesn't really matter what angle it is, because it sets whatever angle it finds to zero. So as soon as I press that, it, the display will instantly say driving. And I'm not sure if you can read it, but that was a dead end. The other display changes. Driving. Turning right. Okay, so now it's in the program.